Okay, let's jump into this. This is Jordan 11 Jubilee comparison video. So this is the UA versus the authentic, the retail. So this is going to be pretty easy to tell. Like I won't get them mixed up or anything because one is a 10 and a half and one is a nine and a half. So the sizing tags, this is one of the sizing tags on them for the 10 and a half and the sizing tag for the nine and a half. And they are very much pretty similar. The only thing is the nine and a half, like this is like off top is more raised up. Like this is just, is more flat. Like, but you can get under there and you can pick it up. But like, I'm not messing with that. But the information on there is exactly the same. But since we're on topic of the box, like the box is a dead giveaway. Like, uh, I thought this box right here would be way bigger. Like this box right here is a, like the size thing. Like this is nine and a half, so it will be smaller. But this, the size of the boxes isn't like a big discrepancy. It's not like uh, this box is so much huger. But you see, you see the, the quality of it. Like this is shiny. This is a, a shiny, flat, smooth surface right here. This, you can see the lines. Well, you can't see the kind of lines in there, but it's just like, it's more of a gray. Like this is like more shiny. This is just like a darker uh, shade of gray and stuff. And then like the boxes, it's a little more beat up. It's not as smooth. Like the surface of it just, just isn't as smooth and everything. So that is an indicator. That is an indicator right there. Just the, the smoothness of the in quality of it. But let's get into the shoe. I don't like when people take too much time on on the uh, the boxes either. Like whenever I'm trying to watch videos like this. But the paper. So I don't know if you care about that. But this is the paper for the retail. Let me get them out. Okay. Sorry for this little delay right here. But these boxes are these boxes are complex. They do it does have a young tag in the uh in the retail. I'ma see if, if the other one has the yum, the yum sticker or whatever in here. Uh, you see this paper, this paper right here, it's all crinkly, it's uh, smoother, I'm not smoother, it's more crinkly, it's thinner and stuff, it's not as good, so the paper is kind of a, a telltale sign. They do have a yum sticker in here as well, they, they have a yum sticker the same as the retail. So... Y'all bear with me. Y'all bear with me. Okay, okay, okay. <sighs> here we go. Here we go. Here we go. So, now let's get into the shoes. Let's get into the shoes, man. And, hmm, like the, the lacing system, the lacing is different. Like, uh, not the lacing system, but I, I did wear these on feet, so it isn't as tight but you see how these are out the box super tight super tight on there the the top is like <laughs> it's compressed this right here this is it's been worn so i'm not gonna see but it wasn't like it wasn't like this just the look of the shoe mm, the leathers the retail is a little a little smoother the leather is a little more smoother. Like, uh, this kind of has like so, a, a slight, like, kind of bumpiness to like the reflections and stuff in it. This one right here is the, a little more smoother. They both have, they both have the widow's peaks and stuff like that. Um, uh, the third spacing and everything, like this material, it is. Pretty much, pretty much, this, this, to me, this, this seems like a little thicker. 
this thing, this seems a little thicker than the uh, the retail. The retail seems a little a little softer, a little softer up in here. So, but that's to the visual eye that really doesn't matter. Let's get into the jump man, the Jordans. Get into the Jordans of it. Uh, see the Jordan on this shoe. The Jordan on this one. Uh, very, very similar. Like, you can't necessarily tell too much. Like, this right here is a little, like, almost touching. So, that's a little different, but maybe that is because they have been on a foot before. Uh, so, that right there is a little, a little fishy. Mm, the Jordan signs, the Jumpman's, like, I was thinking that the retail was going to be, I was thinking this was going to be, like, metal. Because this seemed like this a uh, plastic. And I think both of them are just, like, painted plastic. So, the Jumpman's look pretty much exactly the same let's get to the back of the shoe and this right here come out of, out of the box this look like this so this was kind of like dented up or whatever and it seems a little wider this like here is a little wider the retail you see like there isn't any no in, indentations or anything like that is is perfect it's, it seems like it's a little thinner up in here about the ankle collar portion or whatever. Just see the uh just the quality, the craftsmanship. It is better. It is better, but it's it's minuscule. It is very minuscule. To be honest, like I'm not gonna be one of those like super nitpicky persons like, oh man, and this and that and that. Like I'm not saying get no UAs. I'm not saying get a retail. I'm not not promoting either one of them. But I'm saying like uh like if you buy a pair I if you spend three hundred dollars or something, I want you to spend three hundred on what you' trying to spend it on. Like, don't get taken. But if you and look the inside, the inside of this is a cardboard shoe tree. So let me see what the, what the other the inside of the retail is. I'm not gonna pull it out because. It, it is a cardboard shoe tree as well. So they both come up, come with cardboard. I would usually the 11s come with like the plastic. But let's get to the bottom of the shoe. Try to get the same shoe. So mm, this right here, the retail is very much lighter. This this been worn, but like this was worn on the on foot. So I don't see why it would be that much darker. I don't, I don't, I don't think it got that dirty just from one on foot, but that is how they look. This is very much brighter, brighter, milkier. This is darker. I could say because maybe the the on foot, the carbon fibers are very similar. the The retail carbon fiber looks a little lighter in the gray part, like this gray part right here. Looks a little, oh, let me see something. It looks like that carbon fiber has a little more, yeah, this is, it looks like it would have some texture to it, but it's pretty flat. It's pretty flat. So, that's like things I see, man, like the box off top, the box, look for the box. The leather, the box and the leather, man. Like that is pretty much easy giveaways. Uh, the backs, like check the backs, make sure, make sure the back is straight. Like if it, if it's retail or something, then they they supposed to be DS or whatever. They should look like this. They should look just straight. Like. If they are, if they might have been, and this is before I even had put them on feet, they look like this. They were bent up. So, that is just, it's not a lot of, of telltale signs, but it's just a little something. But that is, that is what I found, man. That's all I can really name as far as uh, my opinion of them. But, 
that that's it, man. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Gonna be the greatest of the most hated. Uh, y'all should be happy this video. I ain't showed my ugly face, but uh, yeah, <laughs> peace out.